a spicy person. So I'm a little scared to tell you the truth. But I'm gonna woman up and I'll try it. Matter of fact, why not just try it on camera? Welcome back to another fitness favorites. We are in March. Can you believe it? The year is going by so fast. Um, I mean, like it's almost summer. I'm here, just sipping a little bit of coffee. It's a, uh, we call it a cortadito. See, you like my little cup? It's from Urban Outfitters. I guess maybe I should say this is one of my favorites, even though it's not fitnessy, but um, it's actually good for like taking little shots of like, ginger or like wheatgrass shots so i guess we can make it fitnessy right so i've got i've actually got some fitness stuff i know that the last one was a lot of food but food and fitness right goes hand in hand plus i love to try new things all the time um which is actually something that i probably spend more money on groceries than i should because I'm always trying things and then like I'll forget that I have it or I don't like it so I just wasted money. What you gonna do, right? Because if not, like the way that I explain it to Kevin is that if you don't try it, how am I gonna know if I like it? <laughs> All right, so let's get to it. First off, um, I guess we'll just get the food stuff out of the way. I found this from another vlogger she is amazing um her name her insta handle is a seven draw she was actually talking about how she bought these um and i went and tried it and i'm obsessed and it's the boom chicka papa okay delirious so it's so good you i think you can buy it in costco the really big one i think i got this on Amazon. I bought these on Amazon, but Costco has them. Um, I think Publix probably has them. It's so good. It's only 70 grams per cup. So it's really good macros. Um, then four grams of fat, carbs is nine, and well, protein's very little, but it's like a great little snack. Yesterday, I actually went to the movies to see the new Marvel America. It's very good, by the way. And I took this, I took a cup of this, and it just hit the spot perfect. Like, I didn't have to have any popcorn, like the regular movie theater popcorn. I didn't have to have any of it. I had my boom chicka pop pop, and I was good. So this is a really, really good find. Um, it's sweet and salty, which I absolutely love, because I, I don't know if you guys have ever had like popcorn, let's say, and like M&M's right after so good this does a trick and um you're not breaking the macro bank all right on to the next lately i have been really into sandwiches and i think that's partly because i haven't been having that much chicken i just started incorporating it this week the chicken again um but i haven't had that much so it's been kind of hard to get my uh, protein up. So I've been having this lentil bread. I would have put this as my favorite, but I ran out, so I don't have the bag to show you, or do I? I'll check. Um, so I've been having a lot of sandwiches because I'll make like tuna sandwiches, and I don't know about y'all, but the sandwiches with chips are life. They are so, so good, and the best part is that I have been struggling getting my protein up because no chicken, like a lot of veggie patties and um, like ground turkey, ground beef has a lot of fat. So it's been hard for me, like really, really hard. I've been struggling. So I found these. Well, this is the box that it came in. It's really good. I bought it off Amazon once again. Um, and I bought this one because it's the variety pack and it brings all of them. So they are Shrewd Food Protein Crisps. So good. They really taste like Cheetos and they've got so much protein. For this whole pack, 14 grams of protein. 
So I've really been getting my protein in thanks to these with having my sandwiches. Plus the lentil bread already has some protein. So it's been like perfect. It's been hitting the spot. Um, I love it. So this is the baked cheddar. This one so far is the one that I've had. It's so good. I have yet to have the brick oven pizza. I haven't had this one yet, but I'm sure it's just as delicious. And the sriracha cheddar. I'm not much of a spicy person, so I'm a little scared to tell you the truth. But I'm gonna woman up and I'll try it. As a matter of fact, why not just try it on camera, right? If I die, y'all could be my witness. <laughs> I'm so dramatic. Not bad, not bad. Like it's got a little bit of a kick at the end, but it's super tolerable. Yeah, I like it. I'm good. I'll give it a nine out of 10 just cause it has a little bit of kick. <laughs> like now I feel it, but it's good. Get yourself the variety pack if you don't know which one to get. But if you just wanna get one, I would say that the cheddar is my favorite. On to more fitness things. If you're a married gal like myself, um, I don't know about y'all, but I don't want to wear my wedding ring to the ring. To the ring. <laughs> I don't want to wear my wedding ring to the gym. And plus, like I'm always training clients and stuff, so I'm constantly in the gym getting like dirty. There's a lot of germs there, so I just don't like it. And sometimes not wearing something on this finger, guys will hit on you, and it's just like awkward. It's like, ugh, can you just get away? So I actually found these, can you see it? Can you see it? These rubber rings, they're so good. I know that they have like a whole bunch of brands that are high on like Kalo, Q-A-L-O, Kalo, Kalo, I don't know how to pronounce it. And they're all fine and dandy, but they're like 30 bucks for this ring. I bought this off Amazon and it brought three and it was like 14 bucks. So I got a different variety. It came in this little packet and it has different colors. I'm always wearing the gold one, but they have like a bronzy one. I don't know if you can see that. They've got a silver one and I think there's a pink. Yes, like a rose gold. There you go. See, so you can stack them. You can wear them just one, just two, like wear them in different fingers they're so good they can get wet i love it i honestly love it i've had it for a really long time um yeah i they do stretch a little so i would size down i had bought these previously these skinnier versions of them but they stretched out way too much so they keep falling so i had to buy these other ones and i bought them in a smaller size and so far so good so definitely if you're married, if you're engaged, um, or maybe you just wanna wear rings to the gym. These are a go, they sell them on Amazon. I will totally link the ones that I bought because it's so much cheaper, 14 bucks. You can't go wrong. Um, my other favorite, this is, or this has been gold for me. It is the Frey Detox Me. Um, it is a post sweating clearing mask. So this company is amazing. I've probably talked on this about them before. Um, I used to, I was a partner with them, but um, I'm not anymore. Not because of anything, which is, I don't know. Um, but I still love their products. And this is great. It's a mask. So it's got like this little thing that you kind of I've used a lot of it. It's just a little mask and it's great for like, once you get out of the gym, let's say that you've got to go run some errands and you're not gonna be able to go home and take a shower, which is my life. So you just put this on and yet just put it on your face, leave it for like five minutes, um, do whatever, like wash your hands in the bathroom and you take it off and your skin just looks so glowy and so like perfect. You can just put like, some tinted moisturizer, some lipstick or some lip gloss, 
and you're good to go like in some mascara and your skin is fresh it's already glowing from this like it's this is heaven this was god sent for fitness girls you gotta get it like honestly a lot of people have been asking me about my skincare um and i thankfully i don't break out and because i don't wear makeup to the gym even though recently i have been just a little bit because uh, you know you get old and well, hold on i'm not saying that i'm old i'm just older clear that up <laughs> But um, I usually don't wear any makeup or anything like that. And I like to give my face time to breathe, my skin. Um, but this has definitely, definitely helped. So this is a go free detox me. I'm not sure if my link might still work. So I will link it here just in case. All right. The last thing. Total fitness total fitness item this roller y'all this is great and honestly I don't know why I've been saying y'all so much it's not like I'm from the south um but sometimes when you just don't want to like I hate foam rolling sometimes just because you gotta like just put your whole body and you gotta move it and you gotta get the foam roller and you gotta place it correctly and uh, sometimes I just don't have time for that and sometimes I don't even feel it as much because I might not be press, uh, pressing hard enough. I don't know. So I got this little sucker. It is godsend. Like my legs, especially after yesterday's workout, they have been so sore in my calves. And you just go like this and like you're moving all that fascia. Whee! It is so good and it's so convenient, so much more than a foam roller. I think I got this off Dix, um, but I'm sure you can find it on Amazon as well. The lighting completely changed, I'm sorry. It's because the sun went down. All right guys, so that concludes my fitness favorites for March. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. I will try. I'm trying to get more fitness related things than just food. Um, so I'll be working on that for next month's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe if you haven't and I'll catch you in the next one. Wait, you guys, I found it. This was the lentil bread that I'm talking about. You see, I've like, only have the butt left of it, so I thought I had thrown it away, but I guess I liked it so much that I'm willing to eat the butt. Yeah, I should not have said that on the internet. Anyways, um, the butt of the bread. Um, it's one degree organic foods. I bought it at Whole Foods. It's uh, lentil grain. Really, really good macros. Um, let me see, hold on. You gotta freeze it, so it lasts longer than regular bread, that's for sure. Um, one slice is 80 calories, 15 carbs, and protein 6 for one slice. So you might be like, oh, 80 calories. It's actually not that bad, like 160 calories for two bread because you are getting 12 grams of protein in there. So that is really good for a piece of bread. It's all natural, um, organic, so it's really, really good for you. I've had sandwiches. Um, I put tuna on this. Um, I've had so many things. Uh, the veggie burgers, it's great. Or just on the side for breakfast, like with my eggs. This is so, so good. And even with some peanut butter. Or cashew butter. I've really been into cashew butter lately. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And subscribe if you haven't. And I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.